give it up for him one more time. <laughs> All right, is Samiello here? All right, you're on deck. Coming up right now, big round of applause for Blake Harrison. Hey! What's up, guys? I'm a mustard and it's stuck to my ass. We're looking good, we're looking good so far. Guys, I want to start this off by just revealing a little something about myself. I feel like we'll make us a little bit closer. And um, you know, we'll just start this night off right. Uh, and that's that I have a boyfriend, guys. I snuck one in, he's mine, and I'm fucking. Guys, I'm Woo! fucking, I'm fucking on a, I'm fucking on a regular, I'm, I'm fucking on a semi-regular. It's okay, guys, I'm fucking on a kind of normal basis. I'm doing weird <laughs> shit with one person and it's working out guys. Um, the one thing though that I have discovered that's bothering me just a little bit um, is, that, um, is that before me, I have I've come to realize that before me, he dated, he dated anyone else. He dated anyone else. He's dated anyone else besides me and it's fucking with me. It's fucking getting in my head, guys. All right, it's really tripping me out that someone else has touched that dick other than me. It's freaking me out, okay? But I have learned to cope with it, okay? I've learned to cope with it. Uh, what's also bothering me is that they have private Instagrams. These bitches have private Instagrams, okay? They are hiding something, and I don't mean to take it personally, but I'm gonna take it personally, and I think they're hiding things from me, and I think there's secrets in those Instagrams. Okay, because one girl, her name is Keenan, and the only thing that it says about her is just this hand emoji, and there's a picture of a dog in it. I don't know what that means, but who needs a fucking dog when you take your insecurities for a walk every day? <laughs> <laughs> I'm fucking right. <laughs> it's okay. I'm dealing with it. I'm dealing with it. I've, I've discovered a new way of dealing with it, and that's just at night. I light some candles. I get a strong glass of Savvy B, and I hold my crystals to my heart chakra. I get these crystals from this girl named Bailey who said she's a Reiki healer, but I'm pretty sure she's just a right, uh, rich girl who just likes a bunch of cocaine. And she reminds me of my cat because I feel like I'm talking to her in a room when I'm getting my crystals, and we're having this connection, and she just goes, dust. And she just gets really caught up in it. I'm like, you're like a fucking cow. You're just looking at dust right now. So, but I get my crystals and I hold them in my with my strong glass of Savvy B. And I just hold his phone in the palm of my hand. And I just take my inhale. And then I just exhale all over to the phone. And I look to see where the fingerprints are. Are there fingerprints on there? What is the code? What is the code? Is it your social security number? Is it your like basketball number when you were like in high school? Like what is it? I put, I put every fucking thing in until I just get locked out of his phone. And then I'm just there questioning my own existence in the dark. You know, and it's, oh, it's okay, guys. Um, it's okay. I'm okay with it because I'm trying new things to keep him interested. And my most recent thing is letting him come on my face. It's a thing I'm trying. It's a thing I'm trying. I don't really like it. I don't know if I'm really good at it because you're on your knees and this, this, like when they like kind of grab your face to like make it happen, like this isn't a good look for me. <laughs> it's not a good look. And then, you, then it happens and you like try to keep your eyes open while you're looking at them because that's sexy. You know, because they always want you like looking in the eye, and, and you're like, it's like kind of, and then like usually they're like rubbing your hair back, like just to like look at you, you know, it's not a good look, it's not a good look for me, I know my angles, and I know that's not one of them, okay, but that's okay, because I'm trying new things, you know, I'm trying new things, I feel like that's the only way to know like your consistency, like what are you good at, you know, like I, I, I've tried all these things, and I know like I always say no when my mom tells me to wear a coat at night. You know, I always say no, like, put your coat on. I'm like, no. You know, I always say sure to drugs. <laughs> you know, sure. You know, I always say no when my mom calls me and asks me if, if anything is okay. You know, it's just a bold no, okay? And I'm always going to have just like a minor panic attack when we realize halfway to the festival that you've forgotten the glitter. All right, you realize halfway to the festival you've forgotten the glitter and we've already decided that you don't look good on my face and now we're just fucked. Okay, thanks guys, I'm Blake. Yeah.